Women in the workplace is another theme entirely. I was down in Toronto and I was uh, speaking to a woman called Heather Chetwin. And we were swapping songs back and forth to de dealing with social protest of one description or another. And she gave me this song here. She wrote it. She happened to be working for the Disabled Workers Union in Toronto. And out of her collection of meetings and memories of that experience, she put together this song called The Grinding Machine. She was only 36 or a little bit more. She worked in a factory down by the lakeshore. She worked in a factory at the grinding machine and she rocked to the motion as if in a dream. She rocked to the motion of the grinding machine. She went from her house on a bright sunny day. She stepped off a streetcar that took her away. And she walked to her workplace at the end of the line. Bought a coffee and chatted and started on time. Well, two sheets of lead come by on the line. She reached to divide them. She thought she had time. Yes, she thought she had time. But her fingers were caught. And the rollers kept rolling as fast as she fought. Well, the shock and the horror appeared on her face as her arm was pulled under at a terrible pace. Yes, her arm was pulled under the grinding machine as she rocked to the motion of a nightmarish dream. She was dragged by the motion of the grinding machine. Azure me, she cried, azure me, she screamed, but no one could hear through the noisy machine. She was found some time later by the next woman down, for the blood of her body on the rollers were found. They fail to install a safety device. The capitalist owners, they never thought twice. And they never had worked at a grinding machine. They just lived all their lives in their own selfish dream. Yes, they lived while she died at the grinding machine. For whom are we working? For whom do we slave? Do they own all our lifetimes and even our graves? We must fight for our freedoms. We must fight for our dreams. We must fight to be treated like we're human beings and not just a part of some giant machine.